I'm Alan Korn. For the past 12 years, Senior Vice President and Chief Medical Officer of the Blue Cross and Blue Shield Association. As you are well aware, the Blues have maintained a strong focus on quality and patient safety, as evidenced by our recently expanded Blue Distinction Program and our incentive programs designed to reduce preventable harms. However, while we remain vigilant in establishing policies and procedures to raise the quality of care, we continue to see more than 200,000 patients each year suffering harm or death in our hospitals. It's a key accountability and a responsibility of hospital boards of directors to create a culture of quality and safety. And as the industry leader, the Blues are in a unique position to make a difference. Today, we will see the first in a series of brief presentations offering strategies and tactics that we, as Blue Plans, can adopt, and most importantly, that you can take back to your local hospitals and their trustees. For unlike our competitors, we not only have a tremendous national influence, but a profoundly deep local presence, and thus have a uniquely blue opportunity to build strong collaborations between and among all relevant stakeholders. Getting boards on board for quality and safety is an initiative launched several years ago by Jim Conway, Senior Vice President at the Institute for Healthcare Improvement. Jim will share his thoughts in the upcoming video presentation about how boards can work with administrators and medical staff to tackle safety and quality issues. As you view the presentation, it will be clear that in the year 2010, these issues remain relevant and finding solutions as critical as ever. Let's take a few moments to watch the video and we'll have time for discussion after.